Hundreds of people turned out for a 5K this morning to honor the memory of a woman who was murdered in Braintree. Her children say the community support is helping them heal. Here's WBZ's Brandon Truitt. They laced up by the hundreds, got together and hit the road. Folks in Braintree running for a pillar in their community in an effort to right her legacy. Two and a half years, it's been very hard, very difficult. It's a never ending roller coaster. We have our highs and we have our lows. Lori Melchionda was killed in 2020 when a man posed as a UPS driver and used a box to hide a gun before shooting her at her front door. Melchionda was a school nurse in Braintree for more than 20 years and people here knew her well. Shortly after her death, the community got together and held a vigil for her, and a strong showing came out from the community. We knew right then we had to keep something going. Robert Melchionda is one of Lori's sons and helped create the foundation this race and its donations support, creating a scholarship for nursing students at UMass Boston. One of the glaring elements of Saturday's race was the warming temperatures and clearing skies right when this race began, and the Melchiondas believe that Lori had every Thing to do with it. You know, she did this for us last year. When we started, she opened the sky up and made it nice and bright, and I had no doubt that she was going to do the same thing today. Juliana Melchionda is Lori's daughter and follows closely in her footsteps. She's a nurse, just like her mom. She very much instilled the special qualities of a nurse in me. For runners, there's a reason behind the race. When this happened to Lori, like, our hearts broke for her. I'm even kind of choking up right now. I mean, Juliana, like, in bodies her mother's spirit and um, you know she just spreads light. This community has this family's back and it's making a difference years later. It's what keeps us going. Just knowing the support that we have, the love that my mom put out there and how much she means to the rest of the community. At the finish line in Braintree, Brandon True at WBZ News. Now 61 year old Robert Bonang of Marshfield has been charged with Melchionda's murder. He had a competency hearing earlier this year but no finding has been reached yet.